I have some news for you guys, okay? I put up a YouTube short, it was called Circle Makes Me Mad. I was not referring to the shape, I was referring to a water bottle, a specific type of water bottle. I bought the water bottle to prove everybody wrong, to prove everybody that they're idiots. Here it is. This is the water bottle. That's the front of the package. They d did such a good job with minimalistic marketing that you can't really tell what's the front of the package. I mean, you can, but it's kind of weird too. This is what the side says. This is what the other side says. The top says circle, believe it or not. Then the back has nutrition facts. The concept behind this water bottle is pretty simple. It injects some juice into the, the water, and then it tastes not like water anymore. Seems simple enough to me. Pretty straightforward. I thought I conveyed this, and I thought I conveyed the idea as clear as I could in the video that I made. Approximately 50 people seemed to think otherwise. I'm gonna be responding to the allegations today. All right, I'm going to be addressing those 50 people's concerns. They have high quality magnetic seals, and if you can hear the quality, You know, sounds quality to me. The first notable thing I found is that there's a thread, a comment, and seven replies. The comment says, bro's mad he couldn't afford one. Well, guess what, buster? Look what I have here. I stole this from a homeless guy, okay? I don't need to afford anything. I can just take it. There's a list of a bunch of replies that get down to global politics and critical race theory about how people not fortunate enough to afford a water bottle and then they're uh, insulting each other. We're not gonna get into that. For how renewable this is focused on being, they have very renewable cardboard pla packaging along with just a little bit of plastic. There seems to be another common theme among commenters on this video. They seem to not understand the idea of hyperbole. I said, this water bottle is like $40, it's stupid. I said something like that. You have to buy a special water bottle, it probably costs 40 to 60 dollars. Then you have to buy the rings. Well. First of all, it's not $40. $60, it's $20. And second of all, you're talking about air up because Circle is full flavor, like juice or soda. Now forgive me for my misinformed takes and my showing a picture on the screen of the actual price for the water bottle and the text on the bottom that says it's actually $20. I never said anything about smelling the stupid water. Okay? Air up is a different thing. Drinking soda is like smoking and you are addicted to it and you just do it all the time and it's bad for you, but you're addicted to it. Vaping is like going to circle instead of drinking soda where it's maybe better for you. Who even knows? There's been no research on it, barely any research, and it may even be worse for you. And then there's chewing mint, and there's air up, where you can just smell the flavor, and it tastes like the flavor because you're smelling it, and it's not affecting the water at all. It's not changing the water, and mint, you're not chewing tobacco or whatever. And then there's just not smoking and drinking water, which is like what you should be doing, which what is good for you. Here's the, the $20 water bottle. It has a little bit of a... You hear that? It has a little bit of a squeaky to it. It feels like BPA plastic, but there's not BPA plastic. I like it because it helps our fellow ADHDers remember, oh hey, I need water to survive because it leaves a flavored aftertaste. I don't even own one yet, but my cousin has one that I drink out of more than he does. If your ADHD causes you to forget to drink water, shouldn't like having a water bottle on your desk be enough? Here's another smoking illusion. <sighs> Two seconds later, oh, I need another hit. I need another hit. The flavor isn't there anymore. I need another nicotine rush. Too much TikTok. My mom said I fucked dogs and I don't like it. Oh. Oh, uh, the TikTok ended and there's no flavor in my mouth anymore. Now I need to get more juice. The first thing I'm noticing about this water bottle is that if you want to use it as a normal water bottle without the flavors, you can't. Because there's just a hole in the top. That's pretty fantastic. Here's the stupid flavors. Nice packaging. Next comment. The water bottle is not enough. Bro's expecting the water bottle to magically transform plain tap water into flavored water by its own. Now, I don't know what this guy is talking about because that's what this does. Um, there's like shit in here in life pod, life sip pod, fruit punch cartridge that changes the flavor. What are you waiting for? We have 35 plus delicious flavors for you to try. Includes 22 ounce bottle, comfort grip lid, and two flavor cartridges. So this is the comfort grip lid here.
Mmm. Comfort. Here's somebody who is just like the exact person that this is meant for and it kind of makes me a little bit angry. I have to have it because our school forces us to have clear water. <clears throat> Drink water! Drink normal water! Oh my god! These insufferable people, they can't drink normal water. Holy shit! This is natural selection at its finest. Die of dehydration. I need it! I need it! I need flavored water! I need another hit! <laughs> give me more crack! Give me more crack! You're becoming addicted to shit! Stop! Mixed berry fit sip. Fit sip. And this one is life sip. Wow. What do you mean? It's not $60. True, I put that in the video. It's not like a cigarette. And it's not really even a ring. That's era. All right, fucker. Here is your stupid, dumb pod. No, it's not a ring. I don't care. There's fucking juice in it. It's not a ring. Who gives a shit? There's not much you can really do with it. You can like play with it, I guess. Um, but you gotta really fill it up with water in order for it to you, to get the most out of it, I feel. This guy is coping, the flavors come with the bottle. So, it's technically $14 for the water bottle and 6 for the flavored water they give you along the, with the water bottle. I don't care. The price is not an issue. It's the product itself. This and this. These are the issue. It is not the price that's the issue. I don't care how much it costs. It's like people on Reddit who you'll make a spelling mistake and they'll be like, Haha, your argument is your argument is stupid because you made a, a spelling error. So that means your actually argument is invalidated because actually that means actually that your intelligence quotient points are lower than my intelligence quotient points. I have more than you. Let's see if I can drink out of this with my feet using the comfort grip. I mean, if it's better be comfortable enough to use with your toes, right? All right, this is the last one that has any sort of notoriety at all. They wrote a whole paragraph. This is an actual mouth-breathing, crayon-eating Reddit user. Man, talk about total confusion. You've never actually tried Circle, but you're saying the word, and you're showing screenshots of Circle bottles, but you're actually describing and talking about Arup, which isn't even the name of Circle. Circle is not $60. Arup is $60. Circle is $19.98 for the bottle, and two cartridges at Walmart, $19.98. Guys, $19.98. Not $20, $19.98, okay? You actually show it being only 1998 in one of your screenshots. That's why I put the screenshot there, Mr. Fella. The screenshot is there to show that the, pr the price because I said the wrong price because I looked it up to show that I was wrong because I'm not an idiot. All right, so maybe not the comfort grip, but maybe with normal foot grip. That could work. That could work for sure. I give it a foot usability of maybe like four out of 10. I could see it working, but not well. That's all you get from the unboxing, really. All right, I've said enough about the reviews. Now I think it's time to get, put some taste tests to the test, tasting. All right, good night, Croatia.